Okay, for real though. You guys, what is up? How are you? I hope you guys are having a great day whenever you come across this video or a great night whenever you're watching this. If you're new to my channel, I'm Jordan. Thank you so much for just checking out a video. Uh, I have been sitting here for like 30 minutes forgetting that I'm needing to film my intro just on Snapchat, listening to music, dancing. This is why my videos take me so long to film. Anywho, uh, I wanted to come on really quickly and just do a very quick intro and let you guys know about this meal prep video. I know you can tell from the title, I'm gonna be prepping for a whole week for only $20. And I wanna just go over really quick how I was able to do all that, like grocery wise, for under the 20 bucks. I know some people just like to skip to the meal part. Go ahead if you would like. I'm gonna be doing a voiceover for that part, so I'll still go over everything in detail. Um, but I do live in California, so I'm able to go to the 99 cent store where they do have lots of canned vegetables and fruit and also a lot of fresh produce as well. Um, everything I'm gonna show in this meal prep is very healthy and a lot of stuff is actually from Stater Brothers as well. It's not just from the dollar store because I know a lot of you guys can't, don't have that near you or can't utilize that. Um, and at Stater Brothers, what's funny is like some of the canned items were like 79 or 89 cents, like even cheaper than the dollar store. I would think in my head automatically like dollar store would be the cheapest place to get all this, but definitely check if you guys have Wincone near you or Stater Brothers. I know their canned, canned items can be um, very affordable, which is cool because I do a lot of meal prep videos on my channel, but I specifically want to start doing some that are super, super budget friendly. I mean, most of mine are, now that I think about it, I don't do any like any meals that are like super extravagant or anything, but um, I know a lot of you guys are in college or high school or you just live with roommates or whatever and you're just on a budget and you still wanna eat healthy. So um, me, myself, if you are already a subscriber, you know that I am going to the gym a lot right now and trying to lose some more weight here by the end of the year. Um, so all this meal prep is very, very healthy. So it's gonna be from Monday through Friday, uh, breakfast, lunch, and dinner, and snacks, all for under the 20 bucks. Because when I think of meal prep, I think of like a typical work week. Most people are home on the weekends to make their meals, or if you're not, and say you do work seven days a week, you're, you can just double these meals or add as many, as much more, get your words out. Um, you can just add whatever ingredients you want to make it fit for you guys. So I hope you enjoy. I'll go over in the voiceover the prices of everything, and I am gonna be using, in this video, my Jack's meal prep bag which I talked about in my last vlog. I owned one last year and lost some of the Tupperwares and then I ordered a new one and I said I was gonna give one away to you guys so I wanted to throw it in this video since this is a meal prep video and it just goes along with it. So check the description box if you guys would like to win one of these. They're amazing, they just hold like all of your meals, an ice pack, um, it also comes with a water bottle on the side and a container for your multivitamin or your supplements, like everything is packed in there. It's just like so easy if you travel and stuff it's awesome. If you don't win the giveaway, these are super affordable. I will link them down below. You can pick up one for yourself. Um, and yeah, let's just go ahead and get into a full week of meal prep for under 20 bucks. Be sure to smash that like button down there and subscribe if you are new here. And let's get started. All right, you guys, so starting off, like I said, I'm using my Jack's meal prep bag, which is amazing. It does come with all the Tupperwares that you need for meal prep, plus an ice pack, and then this little pill container here, which you can do like a multivitamin, supplements, anything that you need to take. It's really convenient, and it comes with a water bottle on the side. Um, so I'm gonna be using that, because you guys know I went up to LA for two weeks. Uh, I'm sorry, for two days this past week, so I filled up that entire thing with meals, and I was showing you here, each container holds two cups worth, so it's actually a lot of food. Um, so first off, I'm just starting with the current supplements that I'm taking, which is the Bliss and the Thyro Drive. I'm just putting those in there so they're good to go for the week. I do take two, um, one of each, 30 minutes before breakfast and before lunch. So I was just filling that up because I was heading to LA anyways. I wanted to have everything done. So I'm just putting that in the bag and we're good to go. And then for the first recipe that we're starting with, I'm gonna start with whole grain pasta. So this was a dollar again at the 99 cent store. You can use any type of pasta that you would like. I just boiled some water and then I'm just popping that in there. Um, this is gonna be enough for six days worth. So I did about three cups of pasta and I was just cooking that. So we're gonna multitask on the meals that I'm doing for lunch at the same time. So these right here, I got medium firm and extra firm tofu. Um, I can get two packets of this at Stater Brothers for 250, I believe. Um, so I'm just gonna start off with one of them here. If you've seen my meal prep videos before, I like to season mine with soy sauce. So I'm just chopping them up into really small squares. This is the easiest way to make sure that it cooks faster. And that's the kikamin sauce right there that I'm using. I'm just gonna put some on there. Um, you can also use teriyaki, like anything that you like. I recommend you give tofu a try with sauce if you've never tried it, it's great. So I'm starting out with this long grain rice. Again, I got white rice and brown rice from the 99 cent store, so it's very affordable. I cooked a bunch earlier in the week, so I was just putting a little bit into each container, 
and I'm actually doing four containers instead of three. You'll see, I forgot the other one in a second, it'll show up. Um, but I'm just doing a base of rice. So this is gonna be my lunch for four days. So I'm starting out with a base of rice. Again, you can do as much as you want. And I had so much food left over, you guys. Like this, I wanna let you know, for the $20, you get a ton of food. It's, it's definitely gonna be enough. So I got this huge thing of green beans from Stater Brothers. This was $1.19. So I just opened that, rinsed those out, and then I'm putting green beans in there. Again, you can use broccoli or asparagus or any type of vegetable that you do like. Or you can just do like kidney beans or olives if you're not really down with the green beans. Uh, but I love these. My son loves green beans as well, so we always have these in the house. So I'm just putting those on there. And I wanted to show you how much I had left. Again, because for the $20, you get a lot of food. Like if you're hungry after a meal, there's going to be leftovers of multiple things, which is great. Um, so I was just finishing that. And okay, this is a really long clip of the green beans. Then the tofu was done. You know that it's done when it's kind of brown, uh, but it's not like burnt or anything. But you can tell that the seasonings have absorbed in there. And the pasta was also done. So all I did was take that tofu and top it off on all of these meals. And like I said, this is going to be my lunch for four days worth. Um, so again, it's a lot of food, it's very filling, and I know some people don't really love tofu, I was always that way as well, um, but once I tried it with the soy sauce, I really liked it, and now, honestly, I don't even crave chicken or any other, like, type of meat, I, I truly enjoy this. Um, I know at first some people are like, tofu's gross, but try it with some sauce, um, hopefully you'll like it. So, those four meals were all done, again, it was like super quick to prep those, and very, very affordable. So, moving on to the dinner. I'm using these other meal prep containers here, which have three different compartments, which I've shown before in my videos. I'll link these down below. They're from Amazon. They're super cheap, and they also do come with um, utensils. So if you order them, it's only like 10 bucks, you get all the meal prep containers and the utensils. So it's a really good investment because they are reusable and reheatable. So I'm putting the pasta in the biggest compartment in the containers there. Um, again, this is gonna be my dinner. And I was just putting all the pasta in there. What am I doing next? Okay, uh, more green beans. I was using frozen ones. I would usually cook them first, but one of you gave me a tip in my last video and said, don't even bother cooking them because you're gonna heat up your meal prep meals anyways. So instead of you heating it twice, I just put them in the containers as they were frozen. So here I'm doing broccoli. So I wanted to switch it up so I don't get sick of anything. So I did half green beans and half broccoli. And then I also did some teriyaki sauce in this meal. And then on the broccoli ones, you'll see I'm gonna do red pasta sauce. I didn't include the sauce in the price of the meal prep because any like seasonings and sauces that you already have at home, you won't have to pay for. And you can use whatever you want. So on the sides, I'm doing a little bean mixture of kidney beans, corn, and garbanzo beans. Um, the kidney beans and the corn were only a buck at the 99 cent store, and the garbanzo beans is a much bigger container, as you'll see here in a second, which was $1.19 from Stater Brothers. So again, everything is still fitting under that $20 mark and you're still getting a lot of food. Um, so I notice personally myself when I have pasta and like all these beans on the side with the protein and the fiber, I'm definitely feeling extremely full after the end of my meals. Um, so yeah, I'm just making a little bean mixture right there, getting that all done. And then I just gave you guys an overview here. Everything here looks really good. These are just meals, again, that my son and I like. You can tailor the sauces or the veggies on top to whatever is good for you and your family. So here I was just um, putting on all the lids, getting everything ready to go. So that's lunch and that's dinner. That's completely done for the five weeks. So I'm gonna show you here in a second an option for breakfast. And then also what I did for some snacks, which I did end up doubling and tripling for my son and myself, but I was just showing you guys here in the video what your options kind of were. Um, so yeah, all these meals are good for a total to four to five days as well, and you can reheat them. You can put them in the freezer, a lot of you ask do whatever it is that you do, but I noticed that they last for about five days total, which is really good. So I was just packing up my little Jack's bag here, again, which I just find is so convenient. I've seen other like six pack bags, which are so pricey, and this one was only 39 bucks. So yeah, um, I've, that's just the one I've been using. And then here for some snacks, I was cutting up some pear halves. My son loves these. Again, so yeah, here I'm just finishing up those pears that I was telling you guys about. Um, this is one of my snacks for the week. And then you'll see in a minute, I was cutting up an apple as well. Um, I like to double or triple the amount of fruit that you're seeing in this video right here because my son also just really loves fruit and we'll just put it in a zip, little Ziploc and we'll be good to go for the week. So I was showing you guys here one of each, but I usually will like um, triple this for the week. And then I'll also do a string cheese for him and a little yogurt because that's just something that he likes. 
So I was just putting those in the little containers as well. And then I wanted to give you guys a breakfast option. This was $3.99 at the store and you get 12 packs. So it's the um, One Fit Cinnamon Roll, which tastes really great. And you can throw like a banana in there or even apple slices, some cinnamon on top and you're good. Or if you guys don't want to purchase that, you can also do rolled oats which I'm showing here, which is $2.99 for an entire, I think it's a half gallon, um, which I got, again, at Stater Brothers, so very cheap. So that was breakfast, lunch, and dinner, and those two snacks. So I was just putting everything together here for the week, and good to go. Again, everything I'm showing from the Jack's bag and the other containers are all microwavable. You can freeze them, you can reheat them. Um, I know that was a huge concern of your guys in my last meal prep video. So you can totally do that. Everything here is done. I'm just showing you everything that's finished. I really hope you guys enjoyed. Let me know down below if you're gonna meal prep this week for yourself or any other cool meal prep ideas that you may have. I would love if you guys can give this video a like and subscribe down below to check out my new videos that I do have coming later this week. Thank you so much for watching and I hope that you guys have a great day. Let's do a song,